Hi everybody, it's me, your old friend Dale Howard. Today I want to show you two tips in this video. First, how to display the status date as a red dashed grid line in the Gantt chart view. And secondly, how to use this to reschedule incomplete work from the past into the current reporting period. So in Microsoft Project, it's Tuesday. I've just met with my project team. My team members have reported their progress. I've entered it into the schedule. Mickey Cobb has reported that she's only 25% done with writing Module 1. And Cindy McNair reported that she made no progress at all on creating the sample files for Module 1 because Mickey is behind uh, schedule on her work. So if today is Tuesday of the week of April the 16th, I want to set the status date as Friday of the previous week. So here's how to do that. We go to Project, Project Information, and in the upper right corner of the dialog, there is a Status Date Pick List button. I want to set this to last Friday, April the 14th. So let me go ahead and click OK and nothing appears on the screen. That's because Microsoft Project, by default, does not display the status date line as a grid line. It does display the current date line. This is this little thin green line here, but we really need to see the status date line, and I like to make it very bold and dramatic. So here's the first trick, folks, to display the status date uh, as a grid line. You go to the Format ribbon, Grid Lines, pick List button, and choose Grid Lines. In this dialog, scroll all the way down to the bottom. Choose the Status Date item. Notice nothing is displayed. So if I click the Pick List, my favorite pattern is the one at the bottom. It looks like dash, dot, dash, but that isn't what it looks like when you display it. Also, for the color, I like to choose Bright Red. That makes it really stand out. So let's click OK and see what we get. Oh, wow, look at that, everybody. See that red dashed line represents last Friday, the last day of last week's reporting period. Displaying this makes it real easy to remember every week to move the status date line to the next week. Now, here's our problem. Mickey was supposed to be half done, but she only got a quarter done. The portion of the Gantt bar that is the light blue that's to the left of the status date grid line, that's called uncompleted work. On the next task, create sample files for module one. Cindy was supposed to have worked on that task, but she didn't even get started because Mickey was so far behind schedule. We cannot allow uncompleted work to remain in the past because that means our schedule is wrong and our resource availability information is wrong as well. So here's how to reschedule uncompleted work from the past into the current reporting period. We go to the project ribbon. Over toward the right end, we click the Update Project button. In the Update Project dialog, we'll select Reschedule Uncompleted Work to Start After. We'll select the entire project option. Notice that Microsoft Project fills in the status date for us automatically as a bonus, and then we click OK. So here's what Microsoft Project did. All the incomplete work from last week is rescheduled into this week, and the project finish, uh, the finish date for this task is delayed into the following week. For the task that Cindy was supposed to be working on, the entire task is delayed into the current week. Now the schedule is correct. There's my two tips. Thanks, everybody.